Hi guys. Hi guys. Good morning. Um, so it's Saturday today. So I was like, oh my god, I can have a really nice Saturday at home. I feel like I haven't filmed a vlog with me at home in a while. So I'm like really I was really excited. I was like, oh my god, I can do like a summer one, like around the pool. It'll be sunny. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's about to storm. It's still like hot, like it's like humid. But yeah, it's about to have like we're about to have a summer storm, which is good because like it's been a bit like it hasn't rained in a while here. Like it's it's pretty dry, but I was like, I can still go for a swim. Um, and yeah, I decided to hang out with you guys today. And I was also... Oh, fuck. Do you ever... So I think sometimes I just start a sentence and I don't really know where I'm going with it. Like, I just start talking and just sort of find the rest of the sentence along the way. I really hope I'm not the only one who does that because it's really gotten to a really bad habit and I'll just start talking and I don't even know... I don't even have anything to say, but I just find something to say along the way. So I need to stop doing that because I want to be, like, a little bit more mysterious. I want to be, like, you know, like, mysterious, but, like, I talk way too much. Anyway, but I'm going to go get, I'm going to get in the pool. I'm procrastinating a little bit because, like, even though it's hot, like, it's, because, because even though, because it, because even though it's hot, it's, like, windy and cold. And I'm cold. I don't want to, I'm scared. You guys make me do the most, oh, it's so warm. Oh my God, it's so warm. You guys, it's actually hot. Like, honestly, wow. God, you guys are a hassle. I'm gonna take you guys with me. We're gonna go, there's some, there's like the orchards down there. I should really, I should really be picking these and putting them in a bowl so we can make like a crumble, like a mulberry. We should make a mulberry crumble today. That's so. Up. Oh, no, not in the mulberry bowl. Oh, sweetie, not in the mulberry bowl. When I'm picking mulberries, I have a rule. One for me and then one for the bowl. It literally feels like it's about to rain any second. So I've got to be quick. Unless I want to be picking mulberries in the pelting room. I have mulberry literally all over my face. I need to fucking, I need to get a grip on life. My lips are literally purple from eating mulberries. I'm literally a child. No mulberries for you. No mulberries. You can have one. No way you actually like that. My mulberry pickers. Now, I'm making crumble. It's literally sunny outside right now. Are you kidding me? I was literally picking mulberries in like the blizzarding rain. I was literally picking mulberries in the blizzarding rain and it's sunny right now. It's fine. It's fine. Like for those of you who watch my other videos, I'm pretty bad. I'm good at cooking, but when it comes to baking, I'm like shit because I feel like the instructions are very precise. You know, you you can't like like if you do one wrong thing, like the brownies end up mushy. Like you know what I mean? Like it's, it's like you have to be really precise. Cinnamon doesn't tell me how much cinnamon, so I'm just gonna you know. But cinnamon makes everything so good. I reckon. Fuck type of cinnamon. And I'm, I'm just shocking at baking. So this recipe, if I can make this, anyone can make this. Like I have say, okay. So how much butter? Oh, I need more sugar. I did 130 grams of sugar, but it's 180. 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, so 50 grams more. My bad, I nearly just made like a diet. I nearly just made like a more healthy one. Fucking no, thank you. No, thank you. Okay, so I need 130 grams of butter. Oh, there's grams here. Sorry, I'll fall. So 50 plus 50 equals 100, it's 100 and like that. Probably shouldn't be cutting this on the book, but like. Yeah, I'm gonna start putting some of the stuff away because I'm getting I'm very getting very overstimulated with the, the 
this chaotic working environment. Dude, I'm not even joking. This is going to sound so bad, but I spent like the whole of Thursday at school editing my vlog so I could upload it. So I've been like kind of very stressed, not like stressed, but like I have like school, like all my exams coming up. So just letting like, just giving you guys a heads up. I'm going to try and still post every Sunday and Thursday. But if for some reason there's not a video posted, like, sorry, but I'm trying my hardest. And, you know, I have like my English exam coming up and like all this stuff. So I'm kind of actually studying for once in my life. So bad at studying. Like I literally can't like sit down and just like recite information and like learn it. And then like, my hair is really annoying me because I can't touch it. 230 grams of butter. There's the wrapper. Was it so bad to say this isn't very buttery? Just read the instructions wrong as per fucking normal. Now I said that this recipe is ever proof. I actually don't think anything, any recipe is simplistic enough for me. I've come to the conclusion. My chocolate thing is, I don't even really like crumble when it's cooked. Like, if I'm being fully dead honest, 10 times better like this. And the thing that makes this combo taste so good is because this is like sweet and like cinnamony, but these are like sour and tangy. Well, I've made the crumble bit. Now I've got to chop up apples and like de-stalk all of those, which is like kind of quite a bit of effort. So, so that I literally had to get in my pajamas because it's like kind of raining outside. It's like a summer stormy day and I was like, I need to be in my pajamas for this, you know? I've destalked all the mulberries. We've got the crumble here. It's like raining outside. And I've got some apples stewing. This doesn't look like the most appetizing thing I've ever seen, but I think that's how it's supposed to be. 